Hey guys, Robin's here with Bird's Pies YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how I made this floral display. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing I started off with was a an empty olive jar and also an empty Diet Pepsi bottle. I decided to cut the top part off of the Diet Pepsi bottle and also the bottom. I used a knife to make a slit and then I used my scissors to cut around the slit. I had my two pieces cut. I took out my scissors to trim off any jagged edges. Then I took the top off of the olive jar and I proceeded to clean the jar and also take the label off. How I took the label off is I just used water. I ran the label under the hot water and I peeled it off with my hand. Now you can use other things like Goo Gone, but I decided just to use it this way because it was easy. And I just kept adding more water and then I used a scouring pad and I got the whole label off. Once I had the label off, I cleaned the rest of the jar with soap and water and then I was ready to dry it and I did do that as well. So I decided where I wanted the top and bottom to go, but I didn't really like the bottom part. I ended up changing it. I found this old candle holder thing in the cupboard and I used that and then I decided I wanted to put some holes in the top and how I did that is very carefully I used a knife to make an indent and then with my scissors I cut in a square pattern around in a square and then I got rid of that little piece so I did that several times more around the top of the bottle so it made like little square windows it's hard to see here next I decided to paint the base and the bottle top white and I used white latex paint to do so and I painted the base but then I realized I painted the wrong side of the base because I wanted to sit the olive bottle on the other side so I had to wait until that dried and then I could paint the other side it ended up working out anyway Then I painted the cap portion of the bottle top. You could put another item at the top, like a golf ball. I saw someone else do a DIY of this, but I decided to leave it. So here's what they looked like once I was finished painting, and I accidentally left it on the paper towel, so it stuck to it. But the next day, I decided to take some of this candle wax and put it at the bottom of my jar because I was going to use it as a scent and it does smell like stress relief, eucalyptus. So I put that at the bottom and then I put the um, some fake plant in there so that, that I had on hand. So I used this green leafy tree so here it goes 
in the jar. And it had these little white seeds on it. And I found these other flowers. These They look like wheat. And I decided to put those in. For some color. Then I moved it around a little to get it exactly how I wanted it and I added some more candle wax at the bottom so it would smell good because you're supposed to put potpourri inside but I didn't want to go take anything from outside. Once I had it how I wanted it, with the flowers and candle wax inside, I took the base and placed it on the table. Then I put my flower mixture on top of the base. And then I took the top and placed that on top. And here it is, my potpourri mini planter. Well, that's going to be it for today. I hope everyone is staying safe. Please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the bell so you're notified every time I upload. Until then, have a nice day. Take care. See you next time. Bye for now.